Now, the worst cyber attack in history. The verdict of Kaspersky Lab, Russia's internet security specialists, on the latest virus assault throughout the Middle East. The malicious software known as Flame has an ability to snatch data like nothing ever seen before. Let's get the latest now from Marty's uh, Tom Barton standing by live for us. Uh, Tom, good to see you. Is it becoming clear who's behind this massive historic cyber attack? Experts at Russian internet security firm Kaspersky Lab are sure that this is a very complex internet virus. The most complex ever, they say. They've dubbed it Flame. The highest number of infected computers are in Iran. But Israel, Syria and other countries across the Middle East have also been attacked. Flame can make use of the computer's webcams, its keyboard, its microphones and other things in order to grab data, package it up and send it back to its controllers. And it's this complexity and the targets that have been hit that have convinced Kaspersky this is a state-backed cyber attack and a very well-organized operation. We suspect that uh, there is a nation state behind the development of this uh, cyber attack. And uh, there are reasons for that. This application doesn't fit into any of existing groups that develop cyber attack tools. And we try not to speculate who might be interested in such attacks. We try to base on uh, pure facts we extract from the code, like maybe language characteristics. In, and in this case, uh, we found only traces of uh, good English used inside of that application. Iran has already accused US of the attack. Kaspersky say it's too soon to tell who's behind it, but they have added that this is a new development in the growing area of cyber warfare and that compared to what's gone before, flame could be classified as a cyber superweapon. In 2010, the Stuxnet virus targeted Iran's nuclear program, but flame has 20 times more code than Stuxnet and it could take years to discover all of its secrets. All right, Artie's uh, Tom Barton there. Thank you.